right, fuck it. Are you, pretty lady man? Hmm. Look at my body. Cat, natter, cat, natter, coke, meth, cat, natter. That screenshot right there, for those who were not around, I believe it was in August, uh, Cabela was in Foodie Beauty's chat claiming that her ex essayed her and she got scammed by an Egyptian man. And you could tell um, Salah was in the chat trying to console her. And it seems like around that time, that's when the whole interaction with her and Salah started. Because if you see the screenshots, Salah is the one that actually reached out to Kybella. And I believe by seeing what Kybella wrote in Foodie Beauty's chat, he saw her as a mark. The whole entire thing was that Salah saw Kybella as a mark. He could care less about what happened to her, nothing more, nothing less. And I believe that's what he does while he's in the chat. He's trying to exploit and see who is the most vulnerable female in the chat and try to take him for that money. Well, I feel like I'm talking to a real dog, a real slave, a pure dog. I'm gonna shit on you and f you and spit on your face. It's over. Oh, I feel like I'm gonna throw up. You know what's funny? He wanted me to protect him and not go live and say that it was him. 
I'm not gonna talk about anything about our private relationship, but can you, well, you know, you can't talk. Why? why? With this lip of Chantal crying, she's not crying about the whole thing. She is crying because her whole little scam that she thought she had uh, the wall over people's head is falling apart. Even though we already knew the relationship is not real. She is crying for herself because she realized how foolish she looks. But she is so determined to make everybody believe that this whole relationship is real, that she is willing to do anything. Get down on your knees, beg me to forgive you. Well, I feel like I'm talking to a real dog, a real slave, a pure dog. I'm gonna shit on you and rape you and spit on your face. And with the last, that last screenshot, you guys pay attention, he asked Cabela for money. And Cabela tells her that he does, she doesn't have any money. I would not be surprised if Salah is running the same scam on 10 different women. And Cabela is the first one to come out. And Chantal will never be the wiser because, of course, she has to prove everybody right. But... I will not be surprised if he's asking 10 different women for money. Live from the pit of hell.